Hey, love. What are you doing? Oh, really? Um, do you have time then or not? <clears throat> well, I thought the two of us could go to the living room, cuddle, and watch a movie. Uh, what do you think? Great. Come with me. <laughs> yes, I have to take you by the hand like that. I have to make sure that you don't run away. <laughs> Well, I picked out a few, and you could choose which one. Or a completely different one, of course, if you don't feel like any of them. So, which would be to your liking? Oh, and there's also another one, but I couldn't reach it. Oh, stop laughing. Uh, seriously, I'm not short. I'm just not tall, that's all. Maybe I'm a bit short, but just a bit. Oh, can you please just give me the movie? Um, a little more to your right. Yes, I thought about Texas Chainsaw. What is so wrong about that movie? Oh, it's not that brutal. Besides, it's not even that long. Well, we also have Scream and... Mitsuma and Shining and... I thought we could watch a little scary movie together since we never do so. But if you don't want to, we can also watch a normal movie, of course. Really? Are you really sure? Okay, thank you. You're the best. <laughs> oh, do you want some snacks? I'll bring some. Uh, you just sit down and start the movie. No, you really don't have to help me. Back with the snacks. Take some. Could you perhaps make some room for me? Thank you. Uh, have you watched this masterpiece before? Then we should watch it even more so, don't you think, love? Oh, um, could you give me the blanket, please? I'm a little cold. Thank you. You know, it's very nice to lay here with you. I actually never thought that anything just remotely nice like this could ever happen to me. Especially because of my problem. I know you don't think it is a problem. But if you ask me, there is nothing appealing to being what I am. I can't even turn into a bat like some of your tales try to teach their children. It's ridiculous. Oh, and have you seen Twilight? <laughs> That's the biggest vampire freak show I've ever seen. I mean, come on. <laughs> Sparkling skin. <laughs> the author couldn't have done better than that. <laughs> you have no clue how hard I was laughing the entire movie. <laughs> I'm sorry if you enjoyed the movie, but it is definitely not vampire girlfriend approved. <laughs> huh? Um, well, it, it is a little hard to pull myself together sometimes. Um, but all in all, I don't have the will to suck you dry. I love you after all. Oh, look, now it's getting interesting. Um, although I know it is fake blood, um, I'm getting a bit hungry. It's like seeing delicious food on TV. Don't laugh. <laughs> and no, it doesn't really disgust me since I'm used to seeing blood. 
though they are some of them pies that can't see blood without fainting. A friend of mine, uh, Sam, he couldn't stand the sight of blood and violence. <laughs> yes, he only drinks blood when he really has to. He drinks some bags, just as I do. I'm not quite sure if I'd ever be able to feed off of you. Simply because it's already not easy to resist sometimes. And as soon as I drink blood, I... I know I'm not able to stop until I'm not craving it anymore. It's not just food to some pies. It's like a drug. A drug you need to live or else you'll... Well, you get what I'm saying. It's not easy. Even if I'd only drink enough to keep you alive and... Enough to seize my hunger. You're going to feel very weak. For multiple days. Your body would need to make up for all the blood loss and... That would take basically all the energy your body can afford. Who knows? Maybe you'd even die without a blood transfusion. Uh, uh, sorry. I just wanted to make my point clear, that feeding off of you wouldn't be a good idea unless I'm experienced. But that doesn't matter, because I don't need your blood. I can just love you, without having to fear that I might kill you. <laughs> I love you a lot, and I hope you know that. Keep that in mind. Oh no, we've missed one of the best scenes. Huh? Oh, yes. Thank you. I'm feeling way warmer now. Do you mind if I place my head on your chest? I'm still not very used to getting up this early. I'm sorry in advance if I fall asleep. I love you. Hey lovelies, stay to my hair. If you enjoyed this audio, feel free to check out my other stuff. And if you want to support me, you can check out the first link in the description to my coffee. Furthermore, I wish you all a lovely day. Bye.